In connection with the murder, the police are anxious to interview a man seen in the vicinity wearing a dark overcoat, light scarf, and soft felt hat. There are seven of you here tonight. One of you's the murderer. Agatha Christie's The Master. This classic theatrical murder mystery is now in its 60th anniversary year. I know for a fact people are hiding things. The play was originally written for the BBC as a short story titled Three Blind Mice for Queen Mary's 80th birthday, as she had asked for a new Agatha Christie. Murder? Oh, I like murder. Christie adapted it for the stage, and The Mousetrap opened in London's West End in 1952. An immediate sellout hit. There are a lot of very strange people here. It is now the longest ever continuously running stage show, a position it has held for an astonishing 53 years. Yes, I'm afraid the weather has us all trapped here. A host of actors and actresses have played the eight characters in the show, more than 400 in all with the famous Richard Attenborough playing Sergeant Trotter in the original cast with his film star wife Sheila playing Molly. I just don't know if I can believe anyone anymore. After a record-breaking 21 years at the Ambassador's Theatre, the mousetrap moved next door to the beautiful St. Martin's Theatre, where it has remained for almost 40 years. So far. When my business is done, I shall go back. This masterpiece of a whodunit continues to engage audiences of all ages. And after 60 years, it is perhaps time for a moment's pause to ask, what are the secrets of the show's success? And I spent a lot of time trying to work out who done it. So I was getting really annoyed because I couldn't do it. <laughs> we've travelled from Manchester tonight to come and see this and we've absolutely loved it. I didn't know who the murderer was until the right to the end. Um, I was wondering why this show had lasted so long and now I haven't seen it tonight, I realise why. Everyone is so trusting, how do we know we can trust anyone? That the mousetrap has run continuously for so long is testament to Agatha Christie's writing skills. She creates wonderful and varied characters, and then she fills them with subtle nuances and storytelling elements that set our imaginations racing. She's a very clever writer. In minutes, she has us wondering, why is he doing that? Or what's she been up to? And then, just as you're feeling comfortable, she throws drama and intrigue into a crooked plot with a murder. You may arrive thinking you know what to expect, but in no time at all, you are totally involved in a tale where each and every character could be the killer. I did warn you someone might get killed. Well, someone here is the murderer. Do you think you know who it is? 